four shepherds and rich wise men travel to find the new king and worship him. Jesus is for everyone! Matthew 2 verse 11 and Luke 2 verse 20. come to the end of our adventure trail well done for making it and i hope that you've really enjoyed it and i hope too that you've heard god speak to you through it now once this story of jesus coming into the world seemed like a distant story that had nothing to do with me but now it's changed my life maybe it's changed yours too it's a bit like when we first heard about covid19 it was a long way away and seemed like it was nothing to do with us and then it came to our country and we had our world turned upside down by it well, this Christmas message can be a bit like that. It was a long time ago. It's a nice story, but not really relevant for me, not really making an impact. And then it does, as it comes close. And rather than turning our world upside down, it turns it up the right way. We do pray that God will continue to speak to you through the Bible and by the Holy Spirit. And if we at Trinity Church can be of any help and encouragement to you in your journey, then do get in touch. We'd love to hear from you. Now for children there's weekly groups on Sundays and midweek and for adults as well as our Sunday services we're running a Christianity Explore course starting on January the 17th that's a Thursday evening. It'll be online so you can be as anonymous as you like and it'll last just an hour. Why not try the first one and see if it's for you. Again details of that and all our groups are on our website. Well a big thank you to Trinity and Clist Heath schools and to members of Trinity Church for contributing to our adventure trail. Thank you too if you've put up a poster in your window or if you've been going out and finding the posters and following online. I hope you've managed to pick up your prize today. And a last and massive thank you to Leanne Dolbin for doing so much work to pull this adventure trail together. Leanne, we're so grateful to you. Well, that's it for 2020. Let's pray that 2021 is full of good news, not just in terms of a vaccine for COVID, but also for us seeing the difference that Jesus can make in our lives. Well, have a very happy Christmas.